Hello. So, I know I look exhausted right now, because I am. Um, you're probably, I'm probably going to miss my face, though I can't wait to lazy to adjust it. Anyway, okay, you know what's annoying me, I'll adjust it. Okay, I'm sorry, like, this is so close up, but it is, like, 10.39 right now. Um, oh, my friend texted me, well, I am me, whatever it is. And, um, I really just burped, ew. Um, anyway, I have actually something important. Not only am I showing on Sunday, but I have, like, a human update. Oh my god. I know, it's shocking, right? Um, so today, I was at school for driver's ed. It's really painful. Um, so I went, I was, like, walking around my school, like, five at night. It was, like, this eye-opening experience for me. Anyway, um, there's this girl, and... She was standing uh, near one of the hallways, and I was like, oh, it's a person. Like, okay, whatever. But then I realized that she was crying, or had been crying. I cannot get over how disgusting I look right now. Anyway, um, I have an afro. After go, uh, 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 after I come out of the shower. Um. Anyway. So. I, um. A few kids actually tried to, like, talk to her. And she just wouldn't respond. She was sitting next to, like, um, in my school. We have, like, a weight room. So I went up to her. And I was like, hey. Um, I have a few minutes before I have to go, so I was just, like, talking to her. Actually, wait. <laughs> so I went up and, uh, I asked her if she'd been crying and if she was okay, and she said yes to both. And then I told her, I have a few minutes, so I can sit here and listen. And that's exactly what I did. A little bit before that. I saw this boy who actually, I know his name, but obviously I won't say it. He was, like, running away and, like, oh, that girl passed out at a party. And, um, apparently she drank too much and passed out. And she almost died. Which not only is terrifying, it's so sad. I was actually uh, recently talking to one of my friends about this. I haven't talked to him like forever, and we finally had a conversation. We talked about a lot of stuff, and that was one of the things we talked about. And we were talking about how it's sad that so many kids in our schools drink and do drugs, and you wouldn't even know because even he's like one of the smartest kids ever, and like this kid has eight IB classes. I don't know how the hell he does it. Um, and he said, like, you'd be really surprised to know which kids even smoke weed, drink, so you'd be, you'd be shocked. And I didn't know, I didn't want to know, because I knew I would be shocked. So, it's shocking, like, you really shouldn't go on stereotypes at all. Um, anyway, so I was just talking to her, and... I end up with a new friend, which was amazing, actually. Um, I was very proud of myself, and I'm happy that she has someone there, and that's exactly what she needed, I think, in my opinion. And the thing is, she's a breathtakingly beautiful girl. Beautiful. Like, people kill to look like her, because she's gorgeous. But, um... I gave her my number and told her, look, if you need anyone, I'm right here. And I meant it. That, what I said to her, every little thing that I said to her, I, I meant. 110%. And, well, if she's watching this now, hi. And, 
don't listen to those people because they're stupid our town is made out of its own species of retards anyway <laughs> well I'm, I might be kidding I'm serious the kids in our school can be so stupid they really are their own species it's just like and I'm, I'm like talking about kids that like walk into the door just to see what will happen like you'll tell a kid that door's locked and he's like no I can open it and he walks right into it and just falls backwards that's like not even that's that happens way too often in my school I have very little hope for the next generation because I've looked at mine anyway so I gave her a friend and I'm very proud of myself for that fact she needed a friend and so did I so let me just tell you like that girl I have to admit she really did make me feel good about myself she told me I was like the first nice person she met in high school which is to me I like wanted to cry because I was so happy that someone thought that of me um, normally I feel like a big well let's put this way a bitch and it's very hard for me to feel like a good person she made me feel like a good one um, I went into my class and I was happy then I saw her again um, peek her head into the hallway but my whole like driver's ed class was there so she turned around and I went to look for her but I couldn't find her but uh hopefully you're doing well and I hope all's okay um so I'll keep everyone updated on my horseback riding this is probably the only time I will mention this girl and no I won't say her name people I talk about on here I never say their names because I need to get my feelings out but this way no legal issues number one number two it's like an I know something you don't know kind of thing so let me feel special <laughs> anyway so I'll see everyone whatever wish me and Maddie good luck on Sunday we're very excited um hopefully my pony won't take off because she likes to do that um alright so I'll see everyone later bye